Can you? All right, here we are, Jamie. Uh, Joe, it's good to see you again. Uh, just you brought something special today and a special guest. We'll get to her in just a second. But what'd you bring today? Well, we brought an Alfa Romeo Stelvio, uh, one of our many dealers, uh, many cars that we have there at Landers McClarty Dodge, Chrysler, Ram Jeep, Subaru, uh, Fiat, and Alfa Romeo. Uh, beautiful vehicle, beautiful vehicle. Uh, they're right there on the same property as the uh, Dodge Chrysler Ram Jeep facility. So, want to bring it out and kind of showcase it today. That's awesome. Does Frank make y'all memorize all those different brands so you can say it right? He don't make you memorize it, but it's good to know it. It is good to know. Well, who, who did you bring today that knows everything about this vehicle? Today we brought Julie, one of our certified and Alfa Romeo Fiat specialists, and uh, she'll tell you a little bit more about this vehicle. Julie, good to have you. Uh, so what, what makes this vehicle special? Well, one thing that makes it, it's a beautiful, sexy automobile for an SUV. Yes, it is, and it's also cost affordable. It's a price point that you wouldn't believe. And that's very appealing to people. And it is Alfa, Alfa Romeo's comeback with an SUV. And, and it's got just a little bit of horsepower, too. A little bit. We're running about 505 horsepower, 300 uh, foot-pound of torque, and it's all in a four-cylinder turbo engine. And I'm going to be honest, Jamie, that's more horsepower than my Mustang has, so that is incredible. And, and then you get the luxury. Now, you mentioned sexy, and that, that is exactly what I would refer to when I look at a car like this. And it's unusual to say that about a sport utility, but it, this car is just has that sex appeal. Is that okay to say? It is okay. You can't help it. It's the passion of Alfa Romeo. That is what they strive for. And it is just, uh, tell me, what was this color again, this blue? Monte blue. That is just a beautiful color. And another thing I noticed about this, now only a car guy is going to notice this, but it has the, the big brake package on it. Yes, because of the stopping power that this such horsepower is going to need, it's got an extra large Brembo braking system on it. We do have available ceramic braking systems as well. So even though it has the Alfa Romeo names on there, those are made by Brembo? They are, and they are hand-painted. Wow, that's a, you know, and that's kind of the extra special touch that you get from a vehicle like, uh, Jamie, that interior there is just fabulous. She was showing me the plush leather that's inside, and then the, uh, you said the uh, ceramic, uh, or the carbon fiber look, carbon fiber um, and you also were telling me that it has, this is the sport model, right? This is the sport model. It gives you three different ways to drive and experience the vehicle. You've got your paddles up on the top so you can downshift and upshift at will. You've also got shift on the fly where you can use a joystick method or go in automatic. So it can be your fun, your fun way of whatever you find comfortable. So you can take the kids to soccer. Mom can go to the grocery store, not only in style, but she can get there quick. Quicker than she's supposed to, probably. <laughs> That, well, Jamie, I, wow, this is just beautiful. Now, we don't want to talk about the other brands, but Joe was telling me that this vehicle did go head-to-head -head against some of your competitors, and it, it either did really well or it beat them. I don't remember what he told me. but well, This is a, a very up-and-coming number one uh, SUV in the market right now. It's very, very competitive, and we're hoping that it continues its trend and follows the Julia, which is going to be the same engine and the same type of trim up, keep on the inside. Just a stylish SUV. It's very lightweight, and we plan to take them all down. That is awesome. Well, I don't doubt that you will. Panoramic sunroof, Jamie. This thing is just... Uh... Now, Joe, do you, do you, you get to drive one of these often? No, not often at all. I got to drive it this morning. It's uh, it, it just it puts a smile on your face when you get behind the wheel, feel the horsepower, the, the, re the reactiveness of the steering wheel. So it's, uh, it's an amazing little, little vehicle. And I suppose that's because of it being the sport package. Not that the, the base model wouldn't be competitive, but the sport model kind of takes it to a whole other level, right? You know, I'll probably have to go back to uh, Landers McClarty Alfa Romeo and uh, grab another one and drive it today just so I can compare. I think Frank will let me do that. I bet he will. I bet he will. I, I wouldn't want to race you in my Mustang in this. I'm telling you, this thing. And for that, for us to be talking about that kind of horsepower, that kind of feel and sport driving mode in a sport utility, a, a four-door family vehicle, this is incredible. Well, you know, Alfa Romeo disappeared from the United States uh, for about 20 years, and we launched back with the 4C uh, to kind of relaunch that brand back into the United States. And uh, this is the the pinnacle. This is this is our. Uh, you know, uh, they're, they're, I guess they're, um, 
the, the name brand, the flagship that they want to have out there to uh, to do it. And you just you can't do that with something regular. You've really got to you got to set the bar out there and set it up high. And I think they, they've surpassed that. Not one. No. And let me tell you what I like about it, Jamie. I'm tired of these cookie cutter vehicles. I'm tired of everything looking the same. When you see the front end on this, when you see it coming, you instantly know that's an Alfa Romeo. Well, first of all, you know it's something different, which I like. I don't like to be like everybody else. But you see that front end, it has such a styling, such a, such a bold look that you, you can't mistake it's an Alfa Romeo. And that's the thing. The brand's been gone for so long. Lots of people don't know what it is, so they'll stop and they'll ask. And when they come by the dealership, and it's really that's you know why we're here, just trying to get it back out. That Alfa Romeo is here to stay. It's a beautiful brand, and uh, we definitely want to shed some light on uh, on that on there. Good deal. Well, Joe, thanks for coming. Julie, good to meet you. Nice uh, for you to come in today. Gloria, you got something else for us today? I do. I just want to remind everyone that the rodeo will be running tomorrow morning, and, and that's going to be the hour special. Of course, that's brought to you by several people. You'll, we want to thank all of our sponsors for making that possible. The rodeo was a huge success, so they're definitely happy about that. And thank you guys for being up here. Julie, that wasn't so bad, was it? Fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're glad. Well, you're just becoming a regular aren't you? Absolutely. All right. Well, they need to go, go and find these guys right here and get you a vehicle. It's going to be great. Well, we've got to get out of here. Have a wonderful weekend, and we'll see you out and about. Bye-bye.